Youth runner here with the uh, Mountain View Bruins, four in a row. Uh, doesn't matter what classification, they've dominated 4A, they've dominated 5A, they've done it better than anybody in state history. 19 championships uh, overall, five in the top 12, all seven of these gentlemen in the top 20. Uh, one of the classic performances uh, in Utah High School Activities Association state championship history. Uh, let's uh, hear from these uh, in incredible athletes uh, about the performance. Uh, just, I mean, obviously you guys could, you know, uh, could visualize like how great that lead pack would be. And then, like mm -hmm. I said, five in the top 12, all seven in the top 20. Like, is this like right at what you guys thought was possible or does it even oh, ex yeah. exceed the expectations? Yeah, I mean, we came into the race hoping five in the top 15 and that's what we were able to do. We stuck to our plan and yeah, Strauss knows what to do. Most definitely. I, I, I so appreciate you talking about, you know, your amazing coaches, your, uh, obviously your incredible teammates, you know, uh, you know, just the support system and whatnot. Like, how significant is that? Because the journey is so long from the summer, and, you know, you guys, you know, it all comes down to, an, you know, one day, and for a lot of people, it's unforgiving. For you guys, it's like, look, we know we've got the right coach. We know we've got, we've got the right support system. It's all going to work out fine. Yeah, I don't know. A lot of that is, you know, just coming together as a team. As you can see, a lot of us have the buzz heads today. I loved it, man. Um, part of that was, you know, just getting closer together, and, yeah, we've been able to grow brotherhood from the very beginning. Most definitely. To, to his uh, wonderful statement about brotherhood, right? Like when you get to celebrate it with people that not only that you, you train you know, uh, so significantly with, but I mean, obviously that you genuinely appreciate each other's company and you guys elevate one another. Like how much does that enhance the experience? I think it helps a lot when you have your boys with you, when you're training, when you're running, when you're racing, it always helps you go faster. Obviously, you know, listening to, uh, to you guys, you kind of talk amongst yourselves and, you know, and, and with coach, like just, how much respect do you have for programs like Orem and the rest of the field and whatnot? Like, I mean, just how, how much does that bring the best out of you guys? Like, we know you, you guys don't take anything for granted. You know, nothing's promised, nothing's guaranteed. Just because we've won 18 before and three in a row, like, we kind of we got to come out and, you know, do it all over again. Like, it doesn't get you any bonus points just because of what you've done in previous years. So the respect that you guys have for the competition, like, how important is that and what you guys are able to execute? Um, I think it's super important. Our coach always teaches us the three R's. It's respect the field, respect the other teams, and respect yourself. And we like follow that as a very important thing. Awesome, great job. In terms of having to respect the course, right? I mean, like I said, yeah. Mountain View's dominated here. They've dominated over at the complex or whatever. But I mean, I always feel like a course like this really showcases why you guys you know are, are not only one of the best in the state but one of the best in the country like especially when, you know when it got to the second mile and the third mile and mm -hmm. the footing's a little you know a little a little dicey yeah. and you know uh, but just how you know how much did it kind of empower you guys to know that you're still looking around and seeing nothing but but white kits and shaved heads uh it's super cool we're super confident in like all of our training leading up to this like we trained super hard for just whatever these hills these hills these hills are tough, but they're they're not anything more than we've ever done, and so we're super like ready for that. It was, yeah, so we had a lot of confidence. Does it mean does it mean more to, to you and the group to uh, to win on like a, a true course like this versus the? Complex? I think it does. I think we like winning on a tough course. The harder, the better. Yeah. The rain, the cold, the hills, we like it. Bring it on! Yeah. Well done. Congratulations. In, uh, in in terms of just how much this group has grown and uh, and developed even back since August uh, uh, until now and knowing that maybe we still haven't even seen your guys' best race, which I hope is on November 23rd in Arizona. But, like, just, like, how good of an affirmation is this of, like, the direction you guys are headed? It's great. We had a we had a great team atmosphere last year, and we've just been trying to build that back up throughout this entire season. And we feel like we really came together, especially in the past month. We've just really become a, an actual team. It's really fun to be a part of that. And being able to celebrate the now, like, this, this group, this, you know, this lineup today, right? I mean, like I said, I can talk about, you know, what used to be three in a row and 18 overall is now four in a row and 19 overall. But just how important is it for you guys to just to be present and celebrate this team today? You know, it's great. We put a lot of put a lot of work into it. Had a had a tough course, a lot of hills, a lot of a lot of a lot of wet ground. It was it was really fun. It was just part of being part of the team. It was just really fun to run this race. Fantastic, great job. In, uh, in, in terms of the strength that you guys draw from each other, like when it gets really hard in training, when it gets really hard in the, in the latter part of the race, like uh, how 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 significant is that uh, has that been, you know, in the in, in the build up for today, just in the, in the trust that you guys have in each other to know that it's like, hey, you know, we do, you know we, we just need to have five be be right on the same day today. Yeah. You had all seven, but like just how, how important is that trust? Um, I think that's honestly the most important thing for me, and I know a lot of the other boys, just because like. When you're having a bad day, 
all of our boys are always they're there for you they they hype you up they get you where you need to be and I feel like that's been a really big help for me this season how much have, uh, have, have they helped you become the best version of yourself because they believe in you so much coach believes in you so much um I think that's the biggest thing that's got me through this season I had kind of had a rough rough start up till now and just they've been there every step of the way they've like I don't know they've just told me that like just like even if it hurts right now it's like it'll always work out I don't know most definitely certainly did today I'm glad I'm glad that yeah uh, you're along for the journey congratulations yeah, thank you and I couldn't be more impressed uh, for uh, the great Kyle Stedman, who has always been one of the best uh, in, in the state, but now can officially call himself a state champion. Uh, I mean, you are all, you're all about the team and all about you know embracing moments like this with these guys. But what does this mean to you? Um, it's really great. Like, you know, I finished and I was like, oh, cool. You know, I won. But then it's looking backward to see where the team is, and that was even more exciting or worth it. You know, to see that we had a solid performance and then we were able to come home with another one. I mean, because, I mean, obviously there's been great, great days uh, for you that have led to the team. There's been tough days for you when they picked you up and, wh and whatnot. Like, just to see it all connect and all click like this, like, mm. as a senior, you know, yeah, yeah. Is, is this, I mean, I know it's, it's not the end of the season, certainly not the end of your career, but like, is this at a state championship, is this like a perfect scenario for you? Um, uh, yeah, pretty much. So, uh, and just, and last thing, I mean, like, how, how much have, just you know, you learn from the past experiences, and like you know, just how much was it? You know, was it was it fueling you for a day like today? You know, just knowing that it's like, hey, you know, I, I want to set my team up the best way possible. Yeah, I I think that's been a big part of it. Is just you know, you know, we're seven. We're you know, we win or lose as, as a team. So the better you do, the better they can do, and it kind of you know sets the tone for everyone. Awesome, man! You certainly did. Great job, Peter. Well, uh, awesome work, man. Congratulations. Uh, just. I mean, uh, what what has it meant like uh, to be able to, to have a group that really wants to challenge one another and really wants to you know motivate each other and push each other and you know and, and see each other achieve great things? Uh, uh, what, what does that mean for you to be part of something like that? Um, you know, it's great to be on this team, to have boys that have the same goals as you and the same intentions as you, because uh, it's like a yoke. You know, you all pull together stronger. So, yeah. How much is the group looking forward to, uh, to the next three weeks? Like I said, it's you know the uh, the story is far from written for you guys. You know, obviously, big opportunity on November twenty third. So, how much are you looking forward to getting better in the next three weeks? Um, you know, team's been seeing the momentum coming together um, inside of running and outside of running. So, we're very excited to see how much we can do just as a team. Awesome! Congratulations! Thank you.